नमस्कार थैंक यू फॉर क्लिकिंग इन एंड वेलकम टू द फर्स्ट लुक वीडियो ऑफ द बजाज वी वन टू इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोन टेल यू अबाउट द प्राइस स्पेक्स एंड फीचर्स ऑफ दिस मोटरसाइकिल लेट्स गेट गोइंग As you can see, the Bajaj V12 borrows the looks of its elder sibling, the V15, which, by the way, has crossed about two lakh units in sales. The V12 can be bought at an ex-showroom Delhi price tag of rupees fifty-six thousand two hundred eighty-three, and can be booked at an amount of just rupees thousand. It has reached dealerships in Mumbai and Pune, and should reach the rest of the city very soon. So the Bajaj V12 sports a 125 cc single cylinder air cooled DTSI mill which Bajaj claims is all new and turns 10.6 bhp and 10.9 newton meters of torque. Now this has made it to a 5 speed gearbox which is an all up system the same that we saw on the V15. I was really impressed with the ergonomics of the V15. Nice upright handlebars, comfortable seating position and well I'm happy to see that that has been translated and carried on To the V12 as well. It also retains a tank capacity of 13 liters. Now a lot of you guys who are probably watching this video right now and are wanting to buy this motorcycle would have fuel efficiency on the top of your checklist. Well, that is something that we are definitely going to cover in a foresight review. Well, the Bajaj V12 gets 30 mm forks on the front, which have about 110 mm of travel, and on the rear you get twin gas shocks, which have about 106 mm of travel. Now the V15 had a disc setup on the front. The Bajaj V12 clearly misses out on that, but the good news is Bajaj is already working on a variant which is going to have the disc as well as the auto headlamp on feature. When you talk about the tire, the V15 was known for its big fat chunky 120/80 section tire. Well, in this case we have the 190 section tire. A lot of things have been carried on from the V15. The ground clearance of 165 mm, the wheelbase of 135 mm, but now this gets a reduction in weight. So this weighs in at 133 kg. So maneuvering in the city and going over bumps shouldn't be an issue, but that is something that we'll check out during our first ride. How do you differentiate the V12 from the V15 then? Well, to answer that, Bajaj have given the V12 two new colors: wine red and the ebony black that you see here. As far as accessories go, well, this gets the same rear cowl that we saw on the V15. To know how to remove and place it back on, all you have to do is click here. When you take a look at competition, it goes up against the Honda CB Shine and the Hero Glamour. When you check the specs on paper, well, these bikes weigh less, have a shorter wheelbase, and are already offering a disc brake variant. And the Honda takes it one step ahead by offering CBS as well. The V12, on the other hand, is a good-looking motorcycle for its genre. makes more power and offers higher ground clearance We still have the first ride video coming up on our channel which will have the fuel efficiency numbers and how this motorcycle performs in the city and on the highway So if you do not want to miss out on that make sure you hit the subscribe button and most importantly stay notified